tell me a little bit about this? Ooh. Sure. It's an interactive table right. for the restaurant. Okay. So you can eat on the table, you can place your food, you can smash a glass. Is, is this an actual restaurant that's yeah, showing? Yeah, that's, that's there's a restaurant in uh, Europe, in, in the Europe? Middle East. Is there one in Seattle that I can stop by and uh, try? Not yet. This not yet. is uh, <laughs> first tables that cross the United States border. Oh, okay. Yeah, so this kind of our debut here. Right. And this uh, table runs on the Windows IT um, Enterprise and Windows IT Core. And we process more than 1,000 touches at the same time. 1,000 touches? Yeah. Oh, sweet. And also, it's the fastest uh, touch screen on the market. So it's three times faster than uh, Apple iPad product. Yeah. So you can try it by yourself, like how it's. So what, what, what would I do with it? Uh, okay, uh, so the table is here. cut for uh, four pieces, for four places, for four people. Right. So, and imagine that you're in a restaurant, so you have a bunch of locations. So, like, we can start from the restaurant. Yeah. So it looks fun just to kind of play with this. <laughs> but yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and here you can uh, order, like, go ahead. Right, you can order from here. Right. So, I'm having trouble deciding what to order, but that's all right. That's click order. <laughs> okay. Was that a bad choice? All right. Okay. Good. Good. <laughs> oh, nice. Cloud and the ticket print of the kitchen. Okay. So the chef knows how to bring it. How we celebrate probably the product. So I'm, I'm like still kind of table. wondering yeah. what else I, what else I would do with this because uh, you can do like game and stuff or uh, like okay. gifting. It's my favorite. Yeah. When you see the lady next table is cute, you can send a glass of wine or connect with it. Oh, it's, it's okay. there's no one else around. That's pretty cool. What else? We got a uh, news. Oh. <laughs> Alright, the news is um, all windows blocked. <laughs> that is a very cool thing to demo. <laughs> IoT enterprise. IoT? Yeah. yeah, and Windows 10 IoT Core. It has two operating systems. Two? Okay. What's the What's the hardware? What kind of processor does it use? Uh, we actually use a dual processor system. Uh, one is uh, running uh, on the Core i7. Okay. And another it's a Raspberry Pi. Okay. Uh, yeah. Right. It's running on Windows IT Core and uh, Raspberry Pi we use for process uh, uh, more than thousand touches at the same time. Okay. And uh, Core i7 we use for uh, graphic layout and for other things. Please, just show up. <laughs> also has a um, Nvidia GPU. Yeah, well, we use uh, NVIDIA graphic card yeah. because it's 4K resolution screen, so we need a lot of power. Oh, it's 4K. Okay. Yeah, it's a 4K, and this is again, this is like an uh, incredible experience. If you try, it, uh, just an example, like draw something here, and after immediately move to the Microsoft Surface app, you feel a difference, like how. Uh, speedy is so the, I mean the response time, and also it's the first table in the world that can uh, recognize uh, your pressure uh, uh, without pen. So it's probably well, yeah. So you can do it like this, or like this. Yeah, cool. Like I can do it even by nail. Like. Right, right, right. So what kind of technology was it used to do that? Uh, it's our own technology. We create a new principle in the touch screen. Okay. Uh, and we call this radio frequency deviation. So it's not projected capacity, but it's not infrared. And this is kind of systems that we create. And this is yeah. that's why we achieve all of this benefit, like thousand touches at the same time, uh, pressure detection, and object recognition. So in restaurants, there are most common scenario when you put 
cup of coffee and uh, the table itself recognizes this cup of coffee and you don't order the dessert. Right. And the table proposes to you like maybe you would like to order dessert in addition. So it's also right. like kind of tools for upselling and improving operational things. Awesome. Cool. Anything else I should check out before I go? Yeah, we have a lot of collaborations, <laughs> collaboration scenario for all family, for example, like puzzle. So it brings attention from the small devices and uh, to people uh, like start to talk to anyone, uh, to each other. Oh. So for example, like puzzle. So all family together can do puzzle. Yeah. I just reboot into demo mode, so this uh, Ooh, air hockey, hockey. Yeah, for, for people. And uh, this also additional revenue stream for restaurant. It could right. be branded by Coca-Cola or beer company. Oh, wow. Oh, I can't go out of this. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> nice. That's cool. That's really all. That's awesome. Chess. Oh, okay. For more intelligent people. Yeah. <laughs> it also have uh, uh, ability to teach how to play. Right. So we, it's a speed chess. We can select the time. We can select the color, and after it have a smart suggestion how to play. Yeah. Just an example here. Okay. So it shows yeah, the, okay. the direction. Ta -da. Nice. Oh, that's awesome. That's cool. it's, cool. it's also pretty, uh, probably a uh, universal Windows platform application. Right, so, right. And uh, that's why it's so like smooth and accurate in the term of visual effects and the graphic performance. Right. So how many, how many restaurants is this in? Uh, we have 11 restaurants in Europe and Middle East. Yeah. yeah. That's awesome. So when's it coming to the United States? I, 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 so. I want to eat my dinner on this, like, tonight. Can I? Uh, no? We have a lunch, <laughs> and we can have lunch here. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Exactly. Yeah, we can, <laughs> yeah, we can uh, eat lunch here. And this kind of shopping center application for poor people. So you can also browse uh, uh, tickets for cinemas that's nearby. Yeah. And you can also s don't spend hours in line. You can see the trailer, discuss okay. with all of your friends. And you also you can select the seats in the 3D. You can select like exactly right. how it. Oh, that's cool. It's kind of a simple feature, but like yeah. people really love it. No, that's great. You can reserve and tap your credit card. So we have NFC built here and over there. Yeah. So and you can Apple Pay or tap your credit card. Okay. Found in Cyprus in Ukraine. Oh, in Ukraine. Where did Cyprus come from? Why does that matter? Is it just because of the restaurants? Uh, Cyprus come uh, because we opened the first restaurant in Cyprus. That was it, right? Yeah. Yeah, and uh, like we chose the Cyprus because. Uh, Almost like 60% of touristic traffic in Cyprus come from Europe, right. and like 40% come from post Soviet Union countries. So it's probably we can analyze different mentalities and how people react. So we choose the Cyprus as a like trial destination. So we put 25 tables in our own restaurant. Uh, so like 18 guys create restaurant uh, without any experience in restaurant, and it was quite successful. It's keep running at, uh, since the time. So it's a seven year. Yeah. Probably How much yeah. would it cost for a restaurant to put this? Uh, every table costs 15,000 US. Euros? Uh, US. US dollars. Oh, US. Yeah. So for a restaurant, normally it's 20 table or 25, so it's like 300,000. 
but the good news is a return of investment that is less than one year because of improving operation you don't need a lot of waiters so for 100 seats you need just uh, two plate runners versus eight waiters right. and revenue stream uh, from advertising and what's the uh, ad platform? Is, is that all sort of is that, is that arranged through the company uh, when you when you buy these for your restaurant? Yeah. So you have your own ad platform, or do you have connections with advertisers? Uh, our platform. In this case, because it's not kind of like digital signage platform, because normally, like you show the movie or something like this, it is completely different because people play with game or with apps like 10 or they're engaging minutes. in a completely different way yeah yeah so we didn't put like uh, advertising itself so we put it in, in some kind of application or gaming stuff that is people really enjoy so we are really afraid to to put a lot of advertising right? people need to enjoy the dining experience and uh, how they communicate with Pepsi or Coca-Cola or right. other companies. So it's all about creating experiences and associating brands with those yes. experiences. Yes, yes. Right. cross-selling also work well. For example, we, uh, in one of our restaurants we did, did some project with Lego. And you can create like uh, for each five minute game, you can create some computer. Right. And after you've done this, you will receive a 5% discount coupon okay. in, store, in store nearby. And this is the perfect scenario for a restaurant owner because he uh, have two revenue streams. The one comes from the Lego marketing budget for promote uh, Lego uh, goods, yeah. and another comes from the Lego reseller because you send the uh, leads uh, yeah. for the show. And this kind of like completely changed the game of the restaurant industry. From experience, it's more than 60% come from advertising. Okay. So what's, what about the growth of your company? I mean, are people, like, do they see this and they think, yes, I really need this in my restaurant? Or are you still sort of working to convince people that this is uh, an idea that can work? There's a lot of money up front. Yeah. We have no customer from the restaurant space at right. all. Okay. So they all, not maybe all, but the people who find us or who we are talking with, they're really conservative. Oh, no. Like, there are no this kind of table in my restaurant, or I didn't believe in the advertising scene, blah, 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 blah. All of our customers from, or uh, some digital advertising company, or uh, this IT background, or resellers, and they open own restaurant, and okay. they're successful. Wow. Yeah, and I think it's need to like take some time uh, to people that feel that it's something normal. And we think that it's not like kind of gimmick one restaurant in country or in city. Yeah. It will be as kind of a tools in any restaurant. Mm. So you said this is currently in 11 restaurants? Yeah. So how many models are, how many devices? Uh, more than 500. More than 500, yeah. okay, right. So when are we gonna get the 3D version? Like where you can interact <laughs> with stuff that sort of stacks up? Um, projector. Uh, probably Maybe we can is. integrate with the HoloLens. See, yeah, that's what we need. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but Although I think maybe it's, that's a bit of a, uh, yeah. Yeah, an awkward dining experience. Yeah. Uh, what we recognize from the surface, uh, like we started seven years ago playing with uh, different tablet devices. Yeah. And we recognize that it's like people use the tablet device just for an ordering system yeah. and then get out from the ice. And this is something more natural because the table itself exists like for a thousand years. And young generation, they really try to put like draw on the paper and I mean the like, children. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they didn't recognize why the paper didn't work, right? And this is something natural and they really enjoy it. And a lot of our strong create own application like for karaoke bar. You can like select the song and put it in a queue. Okay. Yeah. And uh, one of our customers create gambling on the top of this. So you can skip the line. Uh, pay additional two US dollar, right. and all other table receive notifications. That is that guy from that table <laughs> skip the line. Maybe you also would like to, but it costs this kind of auction. Oh, okay, right. Yeah. And, and another thing that is created by our programmers guy that is uh, we call it gift an application, but actually you can select that uh, fill up the lady next table. Buy her drink. Yeah, right. Cool. One of our customers uh, put not just a drink but real flowers from shop nearby. <laughs> wow. And nice. it's in Georgia, and this generates 18% of revenue of the restaurant, just gift selling. 
Wow. And it's, you know, like margin of the gift, it's amazing. Yeah. Nobody cares about how much you pay for uh, flowers. Yeah. That's very cool. Oh, I look forward to seeing one in a restaurant soon. I'm also going <laughs> to get some Starbucks. <laughs> yeah, that'd be yeah, very really cool. So it's 30,000 restaurants across the world, multiplied by 10, 10 tables on average. Mm, that would be quite a good payday. <laughs> yeah. In one moment, we we'll, uh, uh, go to the 10 billion company. Yeah. Just with one client, like Starbucks or McDonald's. Or... Well, you're in the right city for it. There's Starbucks everywhere. Yeah. Right there. There's coffee people all over the place. Well, yeah, good luck. Thank you. Thank you.